Hey beautiful people, it's Rakita and I'm back with another video. So on this video, you guys, I got a question from someone in my comments. They asked me, hey, can you do a review on some airline credit cards? And I want to talk to talk about these airline credit cards because they actually offer pre-approval. So that means if you want to try to see if you can get approved for the credit card before you actually apply for it, so you can just avoid that inquiry, um, it's great for you guys to just go ahead and get that pre-approval. A lot of credit cards don't actually offer that pre-approval option. You got to kind of just go straight into it and straight into the application and just apply. And I don't want you guys to just go straight into application and apply because you may not get approved for a credit card. So let's just jump right on into the video. If you guys have any questions, make sure you drop it down below. Don't forget, you guys, I have my exclusive credit membership where I help you guys remove negative items from your credit reports. I provide you with all the letters. And if you're a member, you also can get the free credit repair where I can actually help do it for you. So make sure you guys go ahead and sign up down below. I have the seven day trial for just a dollar if you guys want to try it out and just sign up for it. But let's get on. Let's get right on into the credit cards. So the first company I want to talk about is Capital One. Now, why I want to talk about Capital One is because Capital One, they have four different airline credit cards. They used to only have like the three different credit cards for travel, should I say. Um, they only have the three different one, but they got the new one, which is the Venture X Rewards. So if this is your first time watching my video, maybe if you want to get the Venture X Rewards, that credit card in particular, maybe you should go ahead and check out that video. But Capital One actually offers pre-approval. So if you want to get pre-qualified for a credit card, even outside of these credit cards, you can go ahead and get pre-qualified for the credit cards. But let's go over a few things that they offer. So they got four different credit cards. This credit card right here, the Venture X Rewards, you can earn unlimited 10x miles on hotel rental cards booked through the Capital One Travel. So Capital One got their own website where you can actually book these different travels and if you actually book it through them you guys will get 10 times the miles on this credit card but these three you will get five times which is really good you guys but make sure that you guys are comparing you know how much it would cost to book through capital one and how much it would be if you guys were just to go ahead and just you know book it on whatever you're going to book it on and you guys will earn five percent miles on flights booked through capital one travel and then the other ones you guys will get the unlimited two. Um, well, I can't even say for the other ones because this one right here, the venture rewards, you guys will get unlimited two X miles on all of the purchases and one and one and a quarter um, X miles on all of the purchases for these two credit cards. And you're going to get the two um, two times miles for all of the purchases for the Venture X, but this is the only one that would give you five times the miles if you guys are booking flights. If you guys are booking flights through Capital One Travel, they'll give you the five X miles. Now, other things that you guys can get too, they have bonuses for when you sign up. So some of these, you guys, they're all gonna vary. One of them is gonna offer the 100,000 bonus miles once you spend 10,000 on purchases within the first six months. I know a lot of people too, like $10,000 you know, $10, on purchases. What I do to get points on my credit cards is I make sure that I put all of my bills, everything through credit cards if I can. Like I told you guys about like how my daycare, the daycare that my children go to, I have to pay them. Um, I pay them two seventy dollars per week for my little ones to go. But if I was to use a card, they're going to charge me like 3%. So I don't do things like that. I don't put that through my credit cards. I just go ahead and pay cash. But other things like my energy bill, phone bills, like those type of things, if I'm doing any traveling, I just put all that on a credit card so I can get the points. So that would surely rack up uh, points for you guys. And some people actually use their credit cards to pay like their rent. Like there's even companies out there where you can pay like your rent with your credit card so maybe you guys want to look into that but it's different um type of offers you guys but you can definitely just look right here and look at the credit cards you want to get and look at the different offers now these two credit cards offer travel benefits where if you guys know about the tsa pre-check <laughs> that's really good i literally just um got my daughter from the air uh, from the airport i can't even talk 
from the airport and the lines were so long, but the um, TSA pre-check line was so short. So you will be, you will get through the line five times faster just having a TSA pre-check, but you guys will get that for free here, which is really good. And you guys will have unlimited um, free access to the Capital One lounges, which is really good. That's only if you get in the Venture X Rewards, but if you just get an Adventure Rewards credit card in general, you guys will get access um, twice. You guys will get two free visits per year. And the other ones, we they, we don't, they don't even have any extra ones, like I said. But, yeah, this is basically all the credit cards with Capital One. They want you to have excellent credit for these three, good for this one here. And you can see they have different APRs and 0% intro for, um, for 18 months. And that's for just uh, Venture One Reward. So that's really good. So you guys can actually, you know, rack up. If you want to spend certain things, you want to pay interest on it, that would be really good when you guys get the 0% intro for 18 months. Now, look at the annual fee because you getting all of this with the Venture X rewards. Like, you get all these different things, but look at that fee that you're going to have to pay every year, which is $395. And then you have a $95 fee here, and there's no fees here. So make sure you balance in whether that's even good for you or not now let's go ahead and click apply now on the credit cards because i want you to see down at the bottom if you do not qualify we may consider you for other credit cards we'll only check your credit once and it won't affect your venture application you'll be able to accept or decline our offer so if you apply for a credit card and they won't give you that credit card they can potentially give you another credit card which is really good and then also if you guys hover over credit cards if you want to see if you can get approved for any of the credit cards you can go right here and see if you're pre-approved and they can actually see if they can pre-approve you for one of their other credit cards they have many credit cards and you see they have like the sign up bonus bonuses for when you apply for them but you just put your information in and they'll let you know whether or not they can pre-approve you for that credit card now, I know we spent a lot of time on Capital One. I'm not going to make this one that long, but you ha you guys will have the American Express credit cards too, where the American Express cards, so if you want to try to see if you can get pre-approved for this, um, all you have to do is just go ahead and ask for them to pre-qualify you, where it says check for others, and put your information in, and then they'll let you know which credit card they can actually um, approve you for. Now they're going to, well, let me go back to Capital One. Capital One, usually will pull your TransUnion Equifax credit score, right? They're going to look at your credit report when they actually approve you. But when it comes down to American Express, they're most likely going to pull your Experian credit report. So you guys, if you see right here, you have the Delta Sky Miles, um, another Delta Sky Miles. This is the gold. This is the platinum. And if you guys um, stand at the Marriott, you guys are staying at the hotels, then this may be a good one for you. But there's different kinds that you can actually apply for. But the best thing, if you want to get approved for American Express credit card, just check and see if you can actually get approved for the credit card. So all you have to do is just, like I said, click where it says check for others. Go ahead and put all your information in, and then they'll let you know whether or not they can pre-qualify you for any of their credit cards. And then just go to their website and look at, like, the total rewards, like the different type of rewards they have for the credit cards. Like look right here too. So your first bag checked is free. You'll get $100 Delta flight credit. But this is too for people that really fly with Delta a lot. Um, I remember my first time even flying first class was with Delta. So, you know, if you guys are flying first class or if you guys are just um, flying in general with Delta, these credit cards may be best for you. So you guys will have an um, you guys will have an annual fee for the first year, but after that will be ninety nine dollar annual fee. You'll earn four forty thousand bonus miles um, after you make a thousand dollars in purchases. So that's really good. So you only have to make a thousand dollars in purchases, and that's good. So yeah, it's different kinds that uh, you guys can actually do. Um, different kinds you guys can apply for. And if you can see right here, this one has a two hundred and dollar two hundred fifty dollar annual fee. Um, you guys can earn 50,000 bonus miles with this credit card. And all you have to do is spend $2,000 and you can get all, um, you can get up to a hundred dollars back in statement credits. And look, they got the TSA too. So free credit for the TSA pre-check, which is really good. 
and priority boarding, you know, first bag is free. It's different things that you guys would get from having these different credit cards. But check them all out, you guys. And if you guys have any questions or if you want me to make a video on certain type of credit cards, definitely let me know. I'll make the video for you. But let me know in the comments if you're able to get approved for any of these credit cards and let us know what the process was for you. I'll see you guys in the next video. There are so many people out there with debt so much debt you guys that they can't even get a car they can't get a mortgage they can't even get a credit card like i mean a 200 dollars credit card some people can't even get a secure credit card so that's why i created my exclusive credit membership and it's only a dollar you guys so my exclusive credit membership you guys will actually get the letters to delete bankruptcies charge off repossessions any negative account that you have in your credit reports i have the letter so you guys can get that deleted but guess what just because you guys are a part of my exclusive membership you can get all those letters, but say if you don't want to do all that work, I have it so that you guys can get free credit repair. So that means I will actually start working to help you remove these accounts from your credit reports. And look right here, look all the results that my clients are getting. So definitely remember, you guys can join my exclusive membership for just a dollar. And I'll have that link down below, or you guys can text SCORE21000 and you guys will have that link. So I'll see you guys in my exclusive membership.